Wayne, we've been in Spain for a couple of training days now. How have you found it so far? Um, yeah, Dan, the facilities have been um, outstanding. I think uh, getting over here, we've had we've had some decent weather, great opportunity to get outside, um, and I think uh, yeah, it, there's a lot of energy in the squad. Obviously, um, a lot of excitement getting out onto the grass, and uh, yeah, it's been it's been a great uh, great start to the, to the tour. Mickey said before the tour he wanted the outdoor training to be intense at Desert Springs. What's that been like? Yeah, it, it has. It re really has been a challenge. Um, I think I think it's uh, going from indoors to outdoors. There's always that energy and that buzz, um, and we want to try and replicate and create what we're going to get first game of the season. So it's 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 very important that as a group uh, for us to keep improving and developing, we have that intensity. So yes, we've set that that uh, that mark and that bar, um, and now it's it's about keeping. The foot on the gas and improving it as we get uh, get to the, the start of the season. Okay, fitness has been a big focus over the winter. With levels going up through the hard work of the squad, how do you think that will benefit the team this year? Uh, yeah, obviously, like fitness is is crucial in the game, um, both uh, from a point of view of executing skills, but also in injury prevention. Um, and I think, uh, as uh, as you mentioned, it this winter we've been. Um, we've had a high level of focus on our fitness, and although the fitness alone won't win us games of cricket, it's surely going to, well, it'll put us in the best uh, position to be able to do that. So, I think uh, really exciting on that front, and seeing the the, the guys develop physique physique-wise, and and getting into a state where we are uh, best prepared to to win games of cricket. It's also a great opportunity for the group to spend some time together and plan for the season. What's the mood like in the camp at the moment? Yeah, it's brilliant. So I think these tours are, from a team building perspective, are great. Um, and uh, there's a lot of banter around. The facilities here are excellent. It's not just, uh, it's not just coming here to, to, to train hard, which is obviously first and foremost, but we've got sort of uh, other, other sport facilities, table tennis at night, bar facilities. Um, uh, so it's 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 brilliant. The guys are the camaraderie at the moment. The mood is 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 excellent, and um, I think for us as a group to develop and grow, this is a, a fantastic place to come to. Who's the best on the table tennis table? Woof! We've actually got a, a, a really good group of table tennis players. I wouldn't say. Wow, there's. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna put one name out there. Actually, uh, there's there's a. I'll I'll, I'll throw a few. Aitchison. Uh, Harry Kames pretty decent. Uh, Reese's pretty good. Uh, Mikey Cohen's got a decent forehand. Um, yeah, there's some there's some good there's some good players out there. I've probably missed a few, um, <laughs> but yeah, some some quality quality table tennis players. Sean Masood and Saranga Lakma will join the group ahead of the first game at Lords. How much are you looking forward to playing alongside those guys this year? Yeah, I can't wait um, to have two quality players, experienced players, uh, join our ranks and and add to us both on the field and off the field, um, both really quality individuals. I mean, Mickey's had a lot of experience with both of them uh, and speaks highly of, of both of them. And, and I've obviously spent a lot of time with Sean um, and really excited to, to team up with him again um, and hopefully uh, spend some time out <clears throat> in the middle with them as well. Um, but yeah, both of them are, are outstanding individuals on and off the field and really can't wait to, to see the impact that they have on our squad. There's less than a month to go now until the season starts with outdoor training and friendlies to come. Do you feel you're ready to get going yet? Uh, yeah, it, it, obviously it's always that build up towards the season. Um, when you're in the indoors and you, you're going through sort of January, February and a lot of stuff, uh, a, a lot of the, the skill stuff that you're working on, by the time you come outside to a place like this, um, you're buzzing and you're, you're raring to go. Uh, and it's still important though that it's... It, it's uh, uh, improving the levels as we go along to the start of the season. So I definitely uh, feel like I'm ready to go and, and the squad is, is ready to go. But there's still, there's still little, little things that, that we want to keep, um, keep improving on and getting better uh, as, as we, we focus over the next three, four weeks before the season starts. Day off tomorrow, morning on the golf course. Who are you backing to take the money? <laughs> uh, Dan, uh, wow. Good. Uh, I know yourself and Edge bought your clubs, so uh, <laughs> um, I, I'm uh, I'm keen for the battle. Actually, I'm looking forward to the the challenge of it. Um, I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go. Who am I gonna go? Golf. 
I'll go Madsen deploy over over Donk and. Uh... <laughs> <laughs>